Hey, good morning, everyone. It's Jamie Zebra 23. So it's like about 5 a.m. right now. So I just had like the most vivid dream ever. Oh, it was so real. Um, put I'm going to describe it, and then you guys put in the comment section if um if you've ever had a dream kind of like this. It was so weird. So I had a dream that it was like current, currently happening. Um, but I was back together with um an ex of mine, this guy that I knew. That we used to live in Sugarland together, uh, this Slick Willie. Um, so I had a dream that, like, we just got back together. And, like, he was just, like, you know, just, like, it's, you know, I, he was saying, like, I can't believe we're back together. I, I never thought we were going to get back together. And he was so happy and so excited. And I was just, like, duh, of course we were going to get back together. We're supposed to be together. And then I'm, like, for some reason, um, I'm, I don't really love candy. I'm just not a candy person. I'm more like, you know, give me like a roast beef and Swiss cheese sandwich with like, you know, on a hoagie roll with onions and lettuce and tomatoes and olives and sub sauce, and mayonnaise. Like, yeah, that's more of my thing. Um, but like I'm eating candy. So I'm like opening up Tootsie Rolls and then I'm ripping open M&Ms and like throwing them up in the air and catching them in my mouth. I'm like, yeah, we were supposed to always be together. And then he's like, yeah, he goes, um... So wherever, wherever we were, it kind of looked like, sort. I don't know, have you guys ever, have you guys ever seen like sort of like a slumlord the way their apartments look? Um, I felt like we were in, if you guys have ever heard of this place, it's called Binghamton, New York. A lot of the apartments, like if you go to Houston, Texas, like when you get rent an apartment, everything's clean. Like it's already cleaned out. There's no furniture in it. You know, the walls have been painted. The carpets have been cleaned. You know, there's no holes in the wall. There's no wires hanging out of the wall. There's none of that. But you go to Binghamton, New York, you know, probably a little bit different. So it kind of looked like an apartment like out of Binghamton um, where like, you know, it, it looked like maybe they just put plywood on the wall and then did like one coat of white paint. So you could kind of see the plywood through the through the thin coat of paint. It just looked run down. He's just like looking around like, yeah, we're moving. And yeah, now that I've got you back with me, you know, let's pack up. Of course, I don't live in a place like what I just described with that plywood. I don't live anything like that. So nobody be afraid for me. I live very well. Um, but yeah, so he's like, yeah, so we're going to get out of here. You know, it's not really safe. And he's like looking out of the windows, looking out of the blinds like, yeah, um, I had a private investigator watching you and, you know, the reason why I stepped in this quick is because, you know, I didn't know if there was any more time left. Yeah. So he's like, I'm like just lit, kicked back, like eating my candy. You know, my kids are running around and I'm just like feeling cool as a cucumber. And he's like antsy, like, okay, you know, all right, Jamie, you know, I know you don't, <laughs> I know you don't like to listen. And, um, but you know, come on, babe, got to get up, got to get up. Okay, come on, come on, kids, let's go. Come on, we're we're going, we're leaving now. Um, no. So I'm just like, why? No. Yes, yes, yes. Your favorite word is no. Mm. Mm, no. Is that your favorite word? Mm. No, no, no. I don't want to wear my shoes. Okay. Um. So yeah, so I'm just like they're cool as a cucumber. I think I was like somewhat aware that maybe it was a dream because I kept thinking to myself, you know, this is too good to be true. There's no way we're back together. So I'm just going to sit here and like keep eating my candy. It's like a big old bag of candy. And it, it almost looks like a Halloween candy haul. So I'm just like thumbing through all the candy, just eating it. And he's just like, come on, you know, come on, babe, you got to go. He's wearing like these white um these like white shorts, like a uh, Bermuda shorts, I guess they're called. And like this button down long sleeve shirt with like ch plaid a little bit, like a light blue colored one. And he just looks really handsome and he looks really, really nice. And I'm just like, just sitting there, you know, with my leg crossed, you know, kicking my leg up and down, you know, just eating my candy, just thinking to myself, wow, this is really cool. Man, I knew we were going to get back together. Like I knew it. And then he's just like, okay, okay, we got to go. And then I just see a big bag of money and then he just picks up the kids and like, is like, are you coming or not? So of course I followed him because he picked up the kids. So I'm like, so, so we leave and then we get into, a, it looked like a black town car or something like that. So we leave and then, um, I woke up and then I was like, what the hell happened here? Like, wh where is, where's Slick Willie? <laughs> like, where is he? And I'm almost like kind of shocked a little bit. Like still, I'm like a little bit bewildered. I'm like, whoa, where is he? <laughs> I, 
I let me know if you guys have ever had a dream like that where it was just like so freaking real. Like all of my visions, all my dreams are real, but this was like the realest one that I've had so far. I'm just like a little bit like, whoa. All right, guys, jamiezebra 23com um, Ta-ta for now. Let me know if you guys have any have had anything like that happen to you.